All right, today's question today. Okay, with uh, recently FTX being in the news of them uh, falling out or going bankrupt, crypto has been uh, been a topic I've been I've been seeing online a lot lately. So, what are, what is our thoughts on crypto? Do you trust it or no, or would you buy it? I don't think I'd touch it at this point. You don't think you'd touch mm -hmm. it? Mm. Yeah, I. I have a hard time trusting it only because I feel like it's so new and it's not really backed by anything. What's I have FT something was FTX. It's like it's like a. It was a like a brokerage, like a coin exchange kind of place Another. where you could buy and sell. Okay. Mm -hmm. Crypto. And it was found out to be all scammy. Yeah. All scammy. Yeah. Yeah, because like <laughs> well, somehow they lost like I don't know how much it was like a hundred million dollars or something like that just like disappeared and they have no idea what happened to it. Saying that they might have gotten hacked, and some people are saying that they were spending it and they shouldn't have been. I don't know. It's a huge mystery. So a hundred million dollars that people have paid in to buy. A lot of it. It's not a mystery though, is it? Is it? Is it? Of, I don't really know. I was gonna say I thought a guy made it to where you could pull out of, like you could withdraw, but only if you lived in like an the island Bahamas. where, like, <laughs> yeah, the Bahamas were like his whole family lived. Oh, so wow. they were just pulling it out. <laughs> what a bunch of other people invested. So <laughs> wow, that's insane. So yeah, and then a couple others have been found out, and people are just like <laughs> uncovering all these scam crypto. Yeah, things. I think. I mean, the business holds some crypto. I think that's overall pretty real. I mean, what yeah. would you say? Like regular money is backed by nothing. I'm not buying anything either. Oh, well, I figured, like, mm -hmm. at least I have the banks or something to, like, help me find my money. Or everybody wants their money at the same time. What's that? Yeah. Until everybody, until wants, everybody wants to yeah, withdraw. Until I was about that. Yeah, yeah. until everybody wants We're to all. withdraw everything. Yeah, that's like, <laughs> that is very true. <laughs> the banks don't have that money either, <laughs> technically. Yeah. But I think it's pretty real. I think, I think that, like, the blockchain technology going to be far more impactful on our future than like crypto as a whole yeah it's, just, it's still so early for it and like no one's really adopted it so like crypto is like the internet in 2000 yeah. everyone thinks like oh it's all going to be awesome and then like five years later nine out of ten companies that were there are gone and the other one out of ten are household names mm -hmm. that's really well put i feel like bitcoin will still be a thing 10 20 years from now, but like, yeah, you can't guess with a lot of, of the smaller ones that people just hype up short term and yeah. then, yeah, pop like, down. Yeah, I was gonna say, mm -hmm. like, you never you can't get involved with all the tiny guys. Yeah, you never know. Say it, Caleb. What are they called? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know the phrase. I was like, I don't know. Either. No, there's a name for they're called shit coins. Uh, oh, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they do a random one to make up so they can, you know, just all pump and dump stuff. I've yeah. just seen too many of those on the internet, especially in like in the fighting scene and like the gaming scene. So many of them have been sponsored and have like tried pushing these coins and stuff, and then months later they're worth nothing. So mm -hmm. yeah, no at this point I'm just like yeah, and saying that's what I'm afraid of. I feel like it's just too new, and I don't really know what to. Try. Yet. True, I'm not. Uh, I'm yeah. not gonna pretend when I'm the most educated person in crypto. Yeah. Even like, I'm not really educated. Even all I know, very, very basic mm -hmm. information how, about it. So, how do you think it would compare with, like, as far as like price unpredictability, something like the stock market? Say, some I'm stocks are really good. Say, some yeah. tank. There's lots of penny stocks that are pump and dump. Also, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I also don't play around with those either. So, I trust yeah. yeah. We trust a guy to do that. I was going to say it's weird how we trust a guy <laughs> yeah. that does that stuff, and then, like, there's probably someone that does it for crypto, but yeah. it's just how people view it all. What What's the actual question here? What is how do you feel about it? Do you trust it? Are you buying into it yet, or...? I'm not. I've seen it fail. I've seen all the other ones, like, the, even just the smaller coins. I've seen all the schemes. I've seen too many of them happen. To now, even if they do have an actual use, and they, do you I think, just, I just couldn't get behind it. You, you think know? don't get involved in crypto or like no name?
Bitcoin going for crypto long. itself. I mean, yeah, I'm yeah, I'm basing all of it. Like I got I had the Bitcoin stuff, not a whole lot of it, mm-hmm. but I I saw it was tanking, and so I was just like, I I gotta get out, and then I was glad I did. So. Oh, nice. What's the whole, what's the live, what's the benefit to it? Yield over there. Hoping it goes up in value is the main yeah, benefit. So you buy it cheap? Higher risk, higher reward. Well, like Bitcoin, what there's, there, there's, a, there's a finite amount, right? And there's some mining process to control the supply. So they're not going to be like 1 million more Bitcoins tomorrow than there are today. Oh. So, so it controls how fast that goes. So like by supply and demand, if supply is fixed or at least really controlled, then the demand will impact the prices naturally by what people want and demand. So you think, oh, you get it now, and then 10 years from now, it's way more popular. Everybody wants more of it, so then they're worth more. Which happened to a lot of people, what, like, oh, nine? Like, the last 10 years. Yeah, Wasn't it some guy paid, like, for pizzas with, like, 20 bitcoins? They didn't know what to do. Yeah. And it was, like, all this money. Like, it's fine. It's all I had. There was, like, a second place video competition, and you won, like, 500 bitcoins. Yeah, <laughs> and it was worth like ten dollars back in the day. Are you sure? How much is it now? I mean, it's probably I don't know what it was. One hundred eighty k. If it's at eighteen thousand dollars or whatever. Yeah, yeah. It's still see. worth. I used to follow a guy. On yeah, Bitcoin is at sixteen thousand dollars per Bitcoin right now. Mm. Like they got to give like five Bitcoins. Then it's like a hundred grand for pizza. Now, so and that's, wow. it's, it's come down a lot this year. So good investment for those people back yeah. in the day still. <laughs> yeah. But I used what? to watch So it's guy. more expensive now to buy, right? Yeah. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. He would just gamble. He would just Bitcoin gambling streams. And he would just gamble hundreds of them all the time. This was like a decade ago. Mm. Yeah, that's so much money now. Wasn't that too like they don't know who actually made it? Isn't that part the, of the what's his name? Satoshi? Was like un- Satoshi, yeah. So they don't they haven't really found out or proved who the actual Satoshi is. I was gonna say someone posted the other day like Creator? ten years he disappeared to the date because it shows when he was like last on geez like or some forum or something. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Man. I'm still for Bitcoin in general. I think especially like Ethereum built on the blockchain. The blockchain is already Chain changing name. what people think is normal it's like the, it's like the iphone people when that came out they're like what am i going to do with this mm. put apps on there and now you live on there yeah because people didn't realize like it was like i fart and it was like it's novelty stuff mm. then you realize well the utility of it is really 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 life impacting and that's going to be blockchain like 10 years from now yeah especially when governments start getting all over it that's it my thing I is know. i I haven't actually started yet. Started it yet. I'm sure if I was to actually start it, put some money into it or whatever, and understand it better, I I would feel better about it. But right now, I'm just kind of like, I have no idea what. Yeah. I'm, like I don't know what I'm doing. You could open up a Coinbase account and just talk to Holly. Say I'm putting a bunch of money in crypto. And that'd be fun. Yeah, I don't know. If it pays that. off, she'll thank you. <laughs> if it pays off, yeah, or she'll kill me. If not, she might not thank you. Yeah. So I don't know. I just feel like once it becomes way more mainstream, and it's like. You know what I'm saying? There's where where it's just well around knowledge. Yeah. That everybody has. You know what I'm saying? I would feel better about it. But right now, it's just way too mysterious for me. For sure. Yeah. Not knowing what could happen in the future. It's far more. It just seems like such a gamble to me. And that's yeah. what I don't the like. The coins are kind of a gamble. Yeah. <laughs> that's why I, I. That's what I don't like about it. But I'm sure, like in a few years, when it doesn't, when it doesn't seem like that, and it seems like more of a for sure thing, like hell yeah, I'll give it a try. I get people that didn't buy Amazon when it was like five dollars a share. <laughs> yeah, I'll see how this business shakes out. Yeah, <laughs> right. When that was unicorn of a bunch of things that went belly up. Yeah, but uh, yeah. So right now, I don't really trust it right now, but I probably will in a few years. So that's my answer. Definitely a high risk, high reward, but I still approve of Bitcoin for the long run. Are we on the crypto? I don't really have. Um, I'm uneducated about <laughs> yeah. the whole entire subject, so I'm gonna stay out of it for now. Obviously, because I don't know anything about it. <laughs> I personally don't know. Like, I think the blockchain is fine, good idea. I don't know if any of like the crypto currencies or anything will ever work, just because I feel like they're majority of the population is like hurt they would be like i don't even know what does this serve me like what do i get out of it well being in a like crypto tied to the blockchain which is not the same thing but are tied in a lot of the coins right imagine like public proof of things so like a house title company 
exactly what they don't, you, you, normally you do that, like, so they're un incentivized in the middle, right, where they don't cheat on either side. Well, can you do a coin to, on the blockchain, and then proof of, you paid this much at this time for this amount, and set all the conditions to release it to the next person. Now, the title company was making like two grand for the transaction, they get eliminated, and you pay like $50 in gas or crypto fees. That's sick. It sounds like a one lot of, of many applications. It sounds like I don't know, but it, is it going? It sounds like it will help most companies with large transactions of yeah. money. I was gonna say, and just remove a lot of fees from that. Can cut a lot of middlemen, a lot of people that make money like on the margins of the service side of things, and will just be cut out way quicker. Is it the blockchain? Mm -hmm. Like a public ledger of transactions. You could be used something like oh proof that you were at a Billy Joel concert, like 20 years from now. I go to the five farewell tour, here's proof I was there. Receipts for it's gonna be big on receipts for like VIP, high privilege type of things. Really be public proof forever that you were there. And people like those stories. Yeah, yeah. I was there. I saw Elton John's farewell tour, right there. Yeah. The proof. Interesting. You're on yeah, Twitter, hey, look at my blockchain. So I can't just photo all the cool <laughs> stuff I have. Can't just Photoshop myself? You can, but it might not be <laughs> as believable. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, it's good to know. I know a little bit more about it than I did a few minutes ago. Yeah. <laughs> so you're sticking with yet. it. I'm. I'm on. I'm on the fence, and you're getting for it. Yeah. Kelly. I'm just uneducated about it. So. <laughs> and Josh. I'm leaning more towards no, but prove me wrong. I guess. Yeah. Really? All right. All right. Well, there, there we have. Anyway, 